Okay, so in the video you're about to see, this thing, uh, it's really actually a little lean when I'm cutting. Uh, open, it was actually at 14.5. I reached it up because I think that's too lean for it. Um, but anyways, it's cutting strong. It still has an idle issue where it'll just like completely pop and die at idle sometimes. I think that's why I'm too small of a carb on it. Uh, or it could be the ignition advance. It's not an air leak or anything like that. It's just, uh, there's a lot of parts that don't belong together in here. So I think that's an issue. I think in the future here I'm going to try and get 372 carb on it. Not right now. I'm going to play with it the way it is for now. Uh, 372 carb on it. Uh, better air filter system. And that's about it. Uh, I'd like to... It's got a piece of silicone bronze welding rod as a choke lever right now. I'd like to get something more permanent on there. But uh, it works. Yeah, the pipe. I cut the pipe down a little bit. Uh, it cuts good. It, it throws chips. I got the E2 trim on here. So... It had more than enough torque for that, even running as lean as it did. So, I mean, one, I richened it up already, but it's going to probably cut a heck of a lot better next time you see this thing. It's, uh, I almost think I might have to run something stronger than 91 octane in here, because between the timing advance and the compression it has now, it's, it bites you. It bites you good. Anyways, enjoy the video. Thanks for following the channel. I appreciate all the subscribers and all the viewers. Uh, and if you're just viewing and not a subscriber, please like and subscribe. That'd be great. Anyways, take it easy. Enjoy the video.